Hey guys, it's your favorite Unc here. Go ahead and click that subscribe button below so you don't miss a single episode of Nightcap. That button right here. Come for the sports, stay for the stories. Ocho. This might be one of the most disgusting things I've ever heard. Uh-oh. 7-Eleven is reportedly <laughs> releasing a hot dog flavored water. Hey. I wonder if anybody in the chat actually knows what hot dog flavored water tastes like. Now, I I know what it looks like. I know what it smells like. But I've never tasted the hot dog water after eating the glizzy. Never, ever. Oh, Growing, Joe. growing up, I, I just, who's coming, who's, who's coming up with these creative concoctions is what I want to know. Think about it, Who Ocho. drinks I'm the thinking, hot dog water in the first place? I'm thinking. Now you know they pay a lot of they pay a lot of money for R and D research and development. Right. Who's sitting in there and say, you know what, guys, I got an idea. Mm-hmm. There's a market that's untapped. It that is, it is untapped. We can be the first into it. We can be the first into it. What is it? What is it? What is it, Stan? Hot dog flavored water. Oh boy, that's a good one. Oh, I don't know. Woo. Nah. And I think <laughs> it, 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 it was it was only. It's the shock value of it in itself is probably going to sell because of the shock value of it being hot dog flavored water. You know how many people are going to try to create content just to taste hot dog flavored water for content no, purposes? No, no, well, no. Unk, you, Unk, you really what about can't... what about what about bologna flavored ice cream? Come on, now I even... Exactly. See what you just did? You see yeah. what you just did? See? Yeah. <laughs> you see what you just did? Not even knowing it. I'm, I'm with you. I'm with you. I'm with you. <laughs> come, come on, Ocho. Something need to be left right. in its original form. Um, yeah. Yeah. But again, stuff like this, <laughs> when it comes to R&D, things that are untapped, you know how we are as a society. Mm-hmm. I got to be first to do this. Because there's something new. Oh, I got to create content. Let me yeah. put this on TikTok. That's, uh, don't somebody got a, 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 a hoo-ha perfume? A perfume <laughs> that smell like the hoo-ha? Smell like they hoo-ha. Like personally theirs? Yeah. How, how would you get the hoo-ha in a, in a bottle and be able to sell it? The same way you get you get a, a, a hot dog flavored water. Yeah, but that ain't I don't I don't know. That ain't I I need I need that, that, that that's not authentic. Well, somebody that, was selling some body, somebody was smelling body, uh uh I don't know, was it Erica Badu? Who somebody I know somebody somebody famous was swept was selling something. Either was a maybe it was a candle. Ash, mm-hmm. look that up. I know I I know I oh Joe, I know I ain't losing my mind. Somebody was selling a a, a, a scented candle that smelled like their body odor. There's really? something. Damn, I ain't, I ain't heard about that one. Ocho, actually, yeah. people have been balling their farts and selling them. Uh, only <laughs> yeah, I mean, hey, you 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 busting it, you dropping bombs around right everybody. Why not? Nah, I don't. Nah, they, 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 selling they, their bath water. Man, you people freaking. You, 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 you Man, people you. freaky. And you don't real. I didn't realize how fe- pre- uh, 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 freaky people was, but I people know. weird. It's not. Is it really freaky? Because we all, we are, we are humans. We, Selling we, dirty underwear. Dirty or clean? Dirty. They say they want them. They want people be buying period panties. For real. Oh, don't nobody want none of your skin mark draws. <laughs> so nah, don't you don't they don't don't you try to get it to the market? Nah, Let them women either. have that. Nah, I, I use baby wipes. I ain't got them problem. Hey, Ash, what what celeb was selling their body odor as a candle or something? Maybe it was maybe it was Gwyneth Paltrow. Maybe it was, but it was somebody. Nah. Gwyneth Gwyneth Paltrow, huh? Then what were they selling? Somebody said, was, was it Erica Badu? Gwyneth Paltrow was selling, uh, somebody was selling candles with body odor, with their body scent, or something. 
I might say it was the Erica Badu. Gwyneth Paltrow sold a vagina candle. Oh, a vagina candle. It smelled now, like a it smelled like a hoo-ha, right? Uh uh eh? Well, why would her well that don't that don't make no sense because why would her hoo-ha actually have a scent? I mean, hey, it smell good or bad, it smells something. You know, you know, I like hey, you know what I'm saying, Ocho? I tell people all the time, hoo-ha like the fair. It get bigger and better every year. That's what I'm looking for, Ocho. That's all I'm hey, Ocho, that's me now. I'm just saying, it's the fair. It get bigger and better every year. <laughs> Hey, I got I, I, hey somebody in the chat. Send me see if they can get me that candle, man, so I can see what it smell like. Erica Badu sold incense that said Badu hoo ha, ah, and I said hoo. And, I like and, that. and so with that I thing like burn, that. that thing, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I like that. I don't, I don't, I don't like, I don't, I don't like incense. That's that's weird, but. That, that's dope. That's that's a good idea, especially for yeah, her. No, that that, that, that fits that fits her whole her whole spiel, her whole mystique. I mean, yeah, so, but who who would have come to the house and God damn, man, it smell like? But you, you know what? You you it's hard to talk about it unless you actually smell it or try it. So I, I it's, it's, it's I ain't really tried to walk in no house and it smell like hoo ha. Well, it depends on how the hoo ha smell. Man, now, look here, it, man, look here. It's hoo ha. Now, as long as, look, I ain't saying, you know, she been working out like she been doing three hours on the bike. Right, 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 right. You know what I'm saying? I ain't just smell like that. I think right. it smelled like bunions. You know what I'm saying, Ocho? Yeah, I know. I know what you mean. But I'm, I'm but sure. But you know what I'm saying, Ocho? I'm, yeah, I know ooh, what you mean. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Listen, if you're selling it, I'm sure it's a delightful smell. How nah, Ocho. Gwyneth Paltrow sold a vagina candle. Yes, it smelled like a hoo-ha. I'm not saying it smelled like her hoo ha, but that's what you know the scent was supposed to be. Well, if her name is on it, then it it, it would have to be. It said this it smells like my, Ocho. She said this smells like my vagina. Okay, okay, chat. I need you to do me a favor. Bye. I yeah. Somebody send me one. I just want one. Mm -mm. Just one. Now see. Now see. Now you die. Now now real gonna say you know. Now you're gonna be have to wear glasses on on, on nightcap for real. No, nah, I mean I'm I'm just curious because I've never I've never come into these type of products before. I've never no. seen these type of products. So I, I think I think it's just interesting. I'm not curious. I ain't I gonna mean, lie to you. I'm not curious. Just 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 for research purposes. No, mm -mm. I ain't trying to research it. All right, I got you. I got you. Mm -mm. I something got you. you know, I so, oh Joe, everything, you know, everything is not shouldn't be brought to the market. Right. But if well, hell, we got hot dog water. Ain't they selling hot dog Again, water? Again, that shouldn't be brought to the market. It, it's probably going to sell well, too. Simply you because so? of what it is. Go to bed. All right, Ocho, you got to keep talking. Hold, hold, hold the chat. All right, chat. Um, I'm not sure what you guys want to talk about. Um, I'm leaving town tomorrow. I'm flying into Houston. If anybody in, is in the chat from Houston, if you'd like to tweet me some um, some places I can I can go eat, um, that would be, that would be nice. Um, anybody in the chat that is from Houston that would like to hang out and, you know, have dinner with me tomorrow, my treat, uh, we, we can all go, go have a good time. We could talk about the show. Um, we could discuss life, uh, anything else going on. I'd be more than happy. I could be a therapist. I could be a counselor at the time. And I think that'd be pretty cool to meet some of you that are in Houston that are in the chat. And that's pretty much it. I'm going to I'm going to sneak up on my daughter. I know she's not watching. I know she's asleep because she has <laughs> class tomorrow. She goes to Prairie View A&M. Okay. So that's pretty much it. Oh, so before we get to that next segment, uh, yesterday at a uh, at an event at one of the uh, liquor stores that I was making an appearance at doing some bottle signing, mm -hmm. I saw a dude. Ocho, I probably whenever we was in training camp. I think it was about 11. We used to train it. We used to go to a training camp up in Greeley. Mm -hmm. Ocho, his mom would drop him off mm -hmm. at like 8.30. Right. He would watch the practice, you know, and I went over there one day, I was signing cards. And every day, Ocho, he have a card. I told him, I said, I ain't signing another card until you bring me a card. So for every card that I sign for you, you've got to bring me a card. Mm 
So every card that I got, and I, you know, I got, I don't have them all, obviously, but he brought them to me. But I saw him yesterday. But his mom used to drop him off at training camp. Right. He watched practice. You know, I let him come in the locker room. I bring him in the locker room, bring him into the meeting rooms. We go eat. He walk. He walked me to the cafeteria. He would go do what he do. Probably go get something to eat. We come back out to go back to practice. He's right. out there. He's out there. I bring him back into the locker room. He be watching. Uh, we had the cold tub. He's just standing around. We go in the weight room. I'm working out. He's standing there. He's still there now. We go eat. Right. We got like probably an hour, hour and a half. Then we go to meetings. Right. He walked me to the meeting room talking. 9.30, we come out of meetings. He's still there. He's still there. Still there. He like 11, 12. He did this. (laughs) He did this from like 93. I mean, obviously he, you know, he grew. I mean, he grown now. He got kids of his own. Right. And he, he had his son there and he was telling him. And, uh, he was just, he was just the, like the coolest kid, man. Right. He was just like, it was just, you know, and I know his friend was jealous because, you know, he was like, he tell the story and they didn't believe him. He's mm-hmm. like, hey, he's like, Shannon, tell him, tell him me and you, me and you cool. I said, yeah, that's my boy. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> man, it was, it was great to see him. That's uh, man, uh, that's dope. Yeah, man.